Hi there, this is Chris from uh, Zazzle Software Greece. This is one of the first tutorial videos that we're going to have uh, on how to use uh, various Zazzle versions um, on our new video uh, channel on uh, YouTube and on our uh, video uh, site on uh, Zazzle.com. So, so today we are going to have a small kick start on how to use Zazzler 24, the newborn Zazzler 24 as you can see. I've already downloaded and installed Zazzler 24 on my computer. So we run it. We will see that it's freshly installed, has nothing inside and what we first have to do with the program is to add songs. Now before we add songs let me show you in my hard disk I've, uh, I've got a, a folder called music and inside this folder I've got other folders uh, where I have categorized the music that I want to play on uh, Jazzer 24 like 80's greatest hits and this one has all the CDs of the 80's greatest hits uh, 12 inch uh, mixes, I love 12 inch mixes um, chill out like and it also has other folders inside with the chill out songs okay and I've also got dance and pop songs and 2010 hits this is how I want to categorize my songs and this is how Jazzer will interpret the songs interpret the folders as categories so when I go back to Jazzler now I go to the audio folders click add new folder go to my hard disk, go my to my music folder and here you will see what I have shown uh, to you earlier uh, I click on the 80's greatest hits it's got all, this, uh, all the other uh, subfolders it, would, it will get all the uh, subfolders in, uh, in that folder and I will add also my chill out and my dance so when I click OK, Jazzler will start uh, finding all of these songs. It has found 331 new files that we can see them shortly in the database. Basically they are already in the database as you can see, but the duration is not determined yet. This is because Jazzler right now is analyzing, is making a quick analyzing of the uh, analysis of the songs and very quickly um, it will show us uh, what are the duration of the songs and on the background while we are working oh, it also, uh, it's also already found the duration of the songs so uh, while we are working uh, Jazzer will be analyzing the songs as you can see here um, and as time goes you will start listening to the songs in the best possible either audio, uh, loudness, uh, music and, uh, and mixing. Now what we have to do basically what we have to do now as we can see we can play the songs too like I can drag and drop the song from here here either we can click on 0, 1 or next so you can play. As you can see we can listen to the song, we can also seek into the song. We can fade the song out as we don't want to listen to it anymore. Um, now what we want to do is to program Jazzler to play what categories we want uh, at what time. What we do is this is uh, at the auto program so we go to the schedule of the auto program, we click on schedule as you see now all throughout the day it's playing random songs because there is no folder set so what happens we want let's say that at seven o'clock in the morning we want to play chill out music so we click add time shift here we write the time in mili military time 0700 and we double click chill out if we want we could click double click chill out again and we could click 80's greatest hits so what happens is that at 7 o'clock in the morning it will start playing chill out chill out and 80's greatest hits we don't want that right now 
so we click only and we leave with chill out so it leaves us with chill out but we want the 80s hits at, at 10 o'clock so we make at add time shift we write 10 o'clock and we put 80s greatest hits two 80s greatest hits and a chill out song and we know now that from 10 o'clock in the morning until midnight it will play uh, 80, two 80s greatest hit songs and one chill out now if you want to make it a little bit better we click add time shift 1300 and we have only 80s greatest hits okay so now we know that from one o'clock in the midday until the midnight it's going to be playing 80 greatest hits but what we want also is that at 12 o'clock from 12 o'clock in the night until 7 o'clock in the morning um, we don't want it to play random songs we just don't want it to play anything like we're in a shopping mall or something like that so you can double click on this and click on silence and click OK and so it will have the program silence mode now if we click on auto program we see that we will play Ultravox as part of the 80's greatest hits clock that we made because this one was programmed from 1 o'clock until 11 o'clock in the night uh, 12 o'clock in the midnight uh, and this is why it's playing 80's greatest hits so that's all for now I hope you understood the basics on how to uh, load songs from Zazzler and how to program uh, the folders. Uh, more videos will be uh, later on. Thanks for watching.